Dragon Age. Okay, so I know it's been like two days since you guys last saw Dragon Age. But it's been nearly four months since I last forgot to record Dragon Age. I'm so excited to be back. I love this game so much. Also, I'm way too loud. Let's turn me down some. That's maybe better. Watch, now I'm going to be too quiet in a little bit. What was I doing? I don't remember what I was doing. Uh, quest log. What was I doing? Acts of Mercy. Can't do that yet. 50 sovereigns. We'll just go out and do some things. We're already out here, we might as well hit Wilmod's camp, right? That makes sense to me. Oh, the spooky juice. You can tell because glowing red eyes and also creepy vein things. Alright, so where are they at? If I could press the right buttons, that would be helpful. They're down, so I want to go up first. Right? Yes. Except it turns out it's a loop. So we're just looping. Oh, dead. I got his belt. Look, I love Dragon Age 2, it's probably my favorite. I definitely am not going to remember every detail of every quest. Uh, I don't remember what I'm doing. That's the, that's the short version of what I'm trying to say. I want to go this way. And take a little peeky up here. There's a Templar recruit, Wilmid. We were looking for him. Oh yeah, now I kind of remember this, sort of. I know I just pulled up my quest log, and I kind of looked at it, but I don't remember the things. They be my witness, Wilmot. I will have the truth from you now. Mercy, sir. Mercy. Were it that easy? Don't hit me. I will know where you're going, and I will know now. I thought Templars only treated mages this badly. Nice to see you're branching out. It's the night captain. Don't. I'll sass whoever I want to sass. Stranger. <laughs> you have struck me the last time, you pathetic human. To me. Oh, cool. Cool and good. We got abomination. Make her preserve us. Buddy, it's really not that bad. I got arrows. And I totally remember how to play this game. Oh, that one's got a bomb on it. It's, oh, it's my stun grenade. That's right, that's right. Let's uh, get out of here. I didn't do that good. Uh, here comes some more. Oops, that's not what I meant to do. Rage Demon. Drop arrows. I knew. I knew he was involved in something sinister. But this... Is it even possible? Do you think he was possessed? No. Normally, we only worry that mages will fall victim to possession. That was the I possession. I have heard of blood mages or demons in solid form who could summon others into unwilling hosts. But I had not thought one of our own would be susceptible. With what I've bumped into in Kirkwall, nothing surprises me anymore. I am Knight Captain Cullen. I thank yeah. you for your assistance. 
I've Remember been him? An investigation of some of our recruits who have gone missing. Wilmot was the first to return. I had hoped to confront him quietly, out of sight. If you didn't know he was possessed, why draw your sword on a recruit? He'd only been back a few days when he left again secretly. It set off some warning bells. I guess that's fair. I meant to scare him into a confession. He had to believe my threats were genuine. Do you know what happened to Wilmot while he was gone? Obviously more than I had anticipated. Wilmot has never been fully convinced of the Order's rules. Majors cannot be our friends. They must always be watched. I thought Wilmot uh -huh. might be meeting with sure. friends who'd escaped the Circle. I've got friends who are mages. Are you saying they need to always be watched as well? I was at the Circle Tower in Ferelden during the Blight. I saw firsthand how Templar's trust and leniency can be rewarded. I still have nightmares of Aldred's depravities. The recruits believed that Meredith was conducting some sort of deadly ritual. What? <laughs> That's preposterous. Mm. Recruits can be worse than a weaving circle with their rumors. There is a vigil before Templars take their arms, but the gravest danger they face is falling asleep. I was trying to find another recruit, a friend of Wilmot's. Do you know where Karen is? He also disappeared. They were last seen together at the Blooming Rose. But I had no luck interrogating the, uh, young ladies there. I doubt they know anything of magic or demons. I'd be willing to search there. The Order would truly be in your debt if you helped us with this. No one at the brothel will speak with me for fear I would shut them down for serving our recruits. If you learn what manner of creature did this to Wilmot, please come tell me in the gallows. I will ensure you are rewarded. That wasn't an abomination. It might have been a possession, but it wasn't. Oops. Hulk. Fenris, why you sound mad? I'm literally doing Templar things right now. You like that. Technically. You just don't like mages. Alright. Let's go pick a... Let's just go finish this quest. Let's do it. We gotta go hit the Blooming Rose at night. Oh yeah, I remember now why I have to uh, go hit the Blooming Rose at night. I remember the quest more. We got it now, guys. No worries. You're probably gonna get mugged at least once because... Uh, that's what happens when you go out at night in Kirkwall, but... And by mugged, I mean somebody's gonna try and jump us and we're gonna use them as a pincushion. For arrows. I turned the wrong way. No, I didn't. No, I did. Hey, we didn't get mugged. Here's the guard captain. Yeah, but there's a box. It's got a poison ring in it. Gotta hit the blooming ropes. It's important. So I can find out what happened to our man Karen. Which is a name I always want to put the syllable on the second or the emphasis on the second syllable for some reason. Make him Karan instead. Oh, I can pick up a new quest here too. We'll talk to you in a sec, Vivica. I gotta pick up the new quest. Jethan. Back again. Sure you're not interested in my many, many services? Uh 
I'm sorry to say that Ninette was killed. Killed? Why would anyone hurt that darling woman? Hard to say. This is horrible. Thank you for letting me know. Please... Please excuse me. You're good. I just figured you should know. They love wars. I don't ask why. Probably don't want to know. At least they tip well. Alright, Vivica. Do you need something, honey? A couple of Templar recruits went missing. They were last seen here. You'll have to be more specific. We do a lot of business with the Templars. We have a lot of missing Templars. If we don't act quickly, we may only find corpses. Now, now, no need to get all dramatic on me. Let me look through the books. Wilmud, Karen... Here we go. Wilmud came in here a lot. You sure he had time to be a Templar? Hmm? Yeah. I don't know. Both of them last saw Iduna, the exotic wonder from the east. Uh, what? That's quite the stage name. It sounds better than the tramp from Darktown. You should hear what some of the others are called. Is there anything else you can tell me? Honey, I could write volumes on the things I know. Unless you want Wilmud's favorite position, I think you have what you need. Fair enough. I'll go. You didn't to hear any of this from me. We clear? Of course. I do not. How do you do? You must be the exotic wonder of the East. Do you remember? Entertaining a Templar named Wilmot a few weeks ago. Or Karen. Wilmot. Wilmot. That doesn't sound familiar. Do your clients like this charade? It must get dreadfully tiresome. Wh uh, wh whatever do you mean? Questions are boring. Why don't we have some real fun? Uh, you may not know anything. You should listen to your friend. We have to ask her about Karen. What's your problem? I don't know. Be careful. As charming and relentless as you are, I'm here to investigate. Answer one of my questions first. Who told you about little old me? Uh, I heard a rumor. It was Vivica. Well, that's not what I she said. She showed me her books. That wasn't so hard, was it? So, Vivica sold me out, did she? That drab, pathetic little sewer rat. She will be dealt with. Just do one more thing for me. Draw your blade and bring it gently across your throat. Oh no, not the murder knife. Bethany, stop her. Let go of... My sister! How did you... Oh, shit. Spare me, Messer. What foul magic was that? Blood and desire in equal measure. An art I learned from... Elsewhere. Blood magic, then? Yes, Messer. Please don't kill me. You're going to answer all my questions. And if there's even a hint of magic? Tarani put me here. To send biddable Templar recruits to the Sanctuary. Three Spear Alley in the Undercity. I enchanted Wilmot and Karen weeks ago. But after they left these walls, I know not what came of them. Please, let me live. 
It's not my fault. It was all Tarane's idea. Tell me about Tarane. Who's she that? put me up to this. She said we can recreate the ancient Imperium. That mages can rule again, not... You just have to go to the modern Imperium she for that. She says the Templars cannot hold against us if we stand up and fight. You know, that's probably true. This base of yours. How many other mages are there? Any other defenses? People go in and out all the time. Sometimes a handful, sometimes more. There are traps. Magical traps. There's a hidden switch at the front. It turns them off. That's all I know. The Templars are coming for you. No more of your tricks. We must purge the sanctuary. The mages must be dealt with. That seems a little harsh, but uh... I'm not really a fan of any kind of purge. I'm gonna work for the pottery when I grow up. Oh. That's good. That's probably not good. Coterie does murders. <laughs> and that is a child. All right. Where am I going now? I think. Oh, guardsmen pretenders. Took too long, there's nobody there now. We really need to get more uh, health on Fenris so he doesn't die. You know, for pretenders, they sure do have some, uh, realistic armor. Wonder where they got that from. Dark Town! Staying at night. The Marin Accord, that's right. I mean, an exalted march happened, so it wasn't optimal, but... Man, I sure hope the next Dragon Age game takes place somewhere up north. That'd be cool. I guess slightly spoilers for Inquisition, but we never go further north than uh, really the free marches. We're pretty much as north as we've seen so far. Didn't I come down here at night? Sure is a bright night time. Let's go see what's going down in this sanctuary. Probably some bad stuff. A whole sanctuary of blood mages. I hope we can stand against them. Yeah, we'll be fine. We got... I don't like the looks of this. That should do it. 
That's good. We're good. Is a ranged heavy team optimal for this? Probably not. It's not stopping me. Arrows! Uh oh. Hey Meryl, stop dying please. Okay, well, that's unfortunate. I flipped into a rage demon. That wasn't uh, quite the goal, believe it or not. I wonder, how much inventory space do I have? Oh, plenty. We're good for a little bit. Some death root, neat. A book about the veil. Uh, cool. Yeah, uh, we got more guys. Or shades? Do shades have gender? Probably not. They're shades. Oops, I can't read a map. Gonna get attacked again real soon, I'm betting. Probably by some of these corpses on the floor. Yup. There sure were a lot of corpses I couldn't search for uh, them to not be about to wake up. Then. Oh, hey, get out of here. Oops, that's not the button I meant to hit. Now you fall. That's such a good line, Meryl. I think I comment on that like once every three or four episodes, but I love that line so much. It's so funny to me. Because Meryl is a little flower kitten and she's out here saying she's gonna have no mercy. Yeah, this is kind of a long episode I'm noticing now, but uh, one of these is gonna be a trap barrel. Yep, there it is. This is kind of a long episode, but I'm nearing the end of this little quest, so let's just... Uh, don't like that. That doesn't look like good things. Why, he's not got a shirt. Who takes a shirt? How wonderful. More vessels for our experiments. Where is Karen? 
Perhaps the demons will find one of you suitable. These mages always fall to the first demon's promise. I am not some hopeless waif that ran crying to a demon. I sought them out and embraced them. Why have you taken the recruits? Demons can inhabit much more than mages and corpses. With assistance, they can control anyone I ask. Any Templar. Any noble. Any well-meaning meddler. You do know I cut a path through your abominations, right? Good, good! The demons like spirit. If a few more Templars fall to the demons, we can seed chaos in their ranks. How many abominations can they discover amongst their own before it drives the Knight Commander crazy? Tell me where Karen is. The experiments need so much fuel, you see. So many living vessels are found wanting. Useless vessels can still feed the compost heap, so it's not a complete waste. Good to know you're barking mad. That makes things easier. In days of old, the Tevinter Imperium spanned the known world. Demons were their allies, held in check by power and knowledge. I'm not sure that's With right. With a wave of a hand, I could do more than a Templar can achieve in a lifetime. Yet they command us. Absurd. That part's probably fair. We should be ruling them. We eh. rule you all. Kill the vessels only if you must. Oh good, a desire demon. Love those. Luckily it's all that's left so we can just stab it one million times real fast. Oh good, that's Karen. But too bad, I gotta get these things. Hmm, yeah, Apprentice's Grimoire. Karen. Is it... is it over? Karen. Yes, that's my name. Oh, thank the Maker. I thought he had abandoned me. Do not trust him. He's likely possessed. Eh. The cage has opened. Thank Andraste. What do you remember about how you got here? I... I was with a lady, and then things got fuzzy. They do not. Nightmares, then. On fire for days. A demon laughing. The naked lady with her razor claws in my chest. Desire demon. I wake and hear screams. Maybe my own. I'm sorry. It's all a tangle in my head. Meryl? You know something about this. Is he possessed? I don't know. It's... It's clean. There's no scent of demons in his blood. Oh, that's good. Go ahead and leave, Karen. You've been through enough. Don't tell the Templars. I... I don't know what they do to me. Please. I need to go back. Tell them I'm alright. Tell my sister. I... I must go. Be careful when you tell Sir Colin about this. If it's not handled correctly, innocent mages may suffer for Tirane's crimes. Yeah, don't you worry. I'm gonna tell Colin as little as I can.
yours. Again. Guess we're going back to daytime. At this point, we might as well do some of this. Actually, man, this is a long episode. Sorry, I will talk to Colin next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>